Hey there, future doctors. Today, I'm diving into the fascinating world of the theory of biogenesis, crucial for your neat exams. So, what is biogenesis? Simply put, it's the concept that life arises from existing life, not spontaneously from non-living matter. This groundbreaking idea was solidified by none other than Louis Pasteur. Back in the 19th century, people believed in spontaneous generation, the idea that life could just pop up from non-living things. Pasteur wasn't buying it. He designed a clever experiment to challenge this idea using a special piece of equipment, the swan neck flask. Picture this, a glass flask with a long curved neck resembling a swan. Pasteur filled the flask with nutrient-rich broth, boiled it to kill any existing microorganisms, and left it to sit. The unique design allowed air to enter but trapped dust and microbes in the curve of the neck. The result? No microorganisms appeared in the broth as long as the neck remained intact. But when Pasteur broke the neck exposing the broth to direct air, microorganisms started to grow. This elegant experiment provided strong evidence against spontaneous generation and supported biogenesis. Life comes from life. For you neat aspirants, remember these key points the swan neck flask experiment, Pasteur's role, and the debunking of spontaneous generation. Pasteur's work laid the foundation for modern microbiology and helped us understand that life originates from pre-existing life forms. By mastering these concepts, you're not just preparing for your exams, but also appreciating the history and evolution of biological science. All right, that's a wrap on Pasteur and the theory of biogenesis. If you found this helpful, give it a thumbs up and share it with your fellow aspirants. Keep studying hard and remember, every bit of knowledge brings you closer to your dream. Catch you in the next video.